Hello friends I am Balaji Rao welcome to BR Max class if you like this video please share it with your friends subscribe to my youtube channel to get more updates find the derivative of secant x by using first principle we know what is first principle of derivative f dash of x equals to limit h tends to 0 f of x plus h minus f of x divided by h this expression is called first principle of derivative which function derivative you want to find take that function as f of x so f of x is secant x as we need f of x plus h f of x plus h is just replace x with x plus h f of x plus h is secant of x plus h now you substitute f of x plus h is secant of x plus h minus f of x is secant x whole divided by h we know the trigonometry formula secant x is 1 by cos x so limit h tends to 0 secant of x plus h can be written as 1 divided by cos of x plus h minus secant x formula is 1 divided by cos x secant of x plus h is 1 divided by cos of x plus h minus secant x is 1 divided by cos x whole divided by h limit h tends to 0 now you observe that the numerator is cos x minus cos of x plus h divided by lcm is cos of x plus h into cos x into 1 by h it can be understood very easily from the above step now we know the formula for cos c minus cos d cos c minus cos d equals to minus 2 sin c plus d by 2 into sin c minus d by 2 apply the same formula here limit h tends to 0 minus 2 sin c plus d by 2 c is x d is x plus h divided by denominator cos x plus h into cos x i am writing minus 2 sin c plus d by 2 into sin c minus d by 2 c is x d is x plus h c minus d by 2 divided by that whole divided by 1 by h written as a divided by h we know this formula limit extends to a f of x into g of x equals to limit extends to a f of x into limit extends to a g of x apply that formula here limit h tends to 0 minus 2 sin x plus x is 2x plus h divided by 2 whole divided by cos of x plus h into cos x you apply the limit for the second function also limit h tends to 0 xx will get cancelled this will become minus 1 by 2 into h divided by h now observe this i'll apply the limit to this function wherever h is there there you put 0 minus 2 sin x the uh, remaining part is minus 2 sin x divided by cos x into cos x now apply the limit to this this part we know the formula that limit x tends to 0 sin ax divided by x equal to a if you apply the same formula here what is a a is minus 1 by 2 now you observe that this numerator 2 and denominator 2 will get cancelled minus minus will become plus you can observe here 1 by cos x can be written as secant x 1 by cos x can be written as secant x and what is remaining sin x by cos x that is tan x therefore if f of x is secant x then its derivative is secant x into tan x from now onwards we take this as a formula derivative of secant x is secant x into tan x i hope you understand this class if you like this video please press like button below share this video with your friends if you are not yet subscribed to my channel please subscribe now thanks for watching bye bye